Hello everyone. I hope that you are all doing well. This is me Sayyad Shujatullah. Welcome to Professional IAS. So today we will be discussing about very important topic that is uh, Bharat Ratna Awardees. So Professional IAS is the only IAS institute across the country that offers curated and customized uh, UPSC planner and strategy for the working professional. Let us go ahead and see our current affair. So Bharat Ratna Awardees, three important personalities we are having Chaudhary Charan Singh. Okay, you can see the picture of him. Narsimha Rao, you can see the very eminent personality of our state that is Telangana. M.S. Swaminathan. These three important dignitaries are going to get what? Awarded with Bharat Ratna. Okay, so let us see their contribution now. Bharat Ratna, let us talk about it. It has been initiated in the year 1950s only. It is a nation highest civilian award and will be given to those personalities that has given distinguished and indelible contributions to the country in various fields. Remember this point, Bharat Ratna is given for various fields, whether you have done excellent work in science, whether you have done excellent work in social, whether you have done excellent work for the farmers, etc. Means it is given for various, uh, you can say that uh, uh, in various fields. So if you talk about Charan Singh, Charan Singh, God is excellent. Uh, he has done excellent work due to, uh, for the welfare of the farmers. He served as a PM also and uh, he was given this uh, Bharat Ratna posthumously. Posthumously is nothing but when a person is given awards after his death. So he is not there with us at this point of time. That's why he is getting the posthumous award of Bharat Ratna. He has done exceptional work with regard to farmers welfare. Okay, now let us talk about Narsimha Rao, the hero of all IIT people who are working in various uh, IT companies. Because of him only, he bought LPG model that stands for liberalization, uh, privatization, globalization. And because of this globalization only, a lot of IT companies came to our country and you people are actually working in IT and BPO sector. Okay, now let us talk about MS Swaminathan. You know that the very famous guy who has saved our country from facing any severe uh, hunger, protected us from famine because he launched Green Revolution in the year 1965 uh, to 1966. Basically, this particular green revolution is to increase the agriculture production. One more important aspect about this uh, about this personality is he, because of the introduction of his uh, um, green revolution, India has never seen a famine in our country. Remember this point and during his term, Indira Gandhi ji was also the Prime Minister of our country. Thanks a lot for hearing to me. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Take care.